Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll be explaining one of the most useful features in Altium PCB Designer. The name of this feature is Design Reuse. This feature is mainly used for reusing one element or a module in one circuit in one project with other schematics in other projects. That means when you start a project and you are using one element or one module that you have drawn in other schematics, you won't have to start drawing everything from scratch. You can simply reuse that module directly in the new circuit that you are drawing. So in order to get started, let me introduce you to this design reuse panel. For some of you, there might not be this panel available here. If you don't, you don't have to worry. So let me show you how you can activate this panel. So let me close this. Okay. So now if you see, we don't have that panel here anymore. So in order to open that panel, simply go to view panels and here under projects, we can see design reuse. Simply click on that and that will open a new panel. All right. Now, if you look into this panel, you can see a drop down. And if you click on that, you will see a workspace that we created in the last video and the local machine. So for the time being, let's select this root set workspace. All right. Now let's go back to project, open a project. So if you have been watching your videos, one of the most common modules that we use in almost all of our projects is this regulator module. All right. Here we have a 7805 voltage regulator. The input is connected to the voltage input, which is usually 12 volt DC adapter or a 9 volt battery. All right. And the ground pin is connected to ground and the output is connected to a net label with name 5 volt and the other end of the output is connected to a voltage divider circuit which will divide this 5 volt to a 3.3 volt dc supply so let's name this a regulator module so this is something that we'll be using in most of our project okay so let's create a reuse block a design reuse block for this module so for that simply select all these elements all right now simply right click Go to snippets and click on create snippet from selected objects. All right. Now let's give it a name. Let's name it regulator module. And let's give it a description. We can either save this reuse block to our workspace online or we can save it in our local machine. So for the time being, let's select the workspace. All right. Now simply click on create. Now this design reuse block has been generated. In order to see that, simply go to design reuse panel and here simply select the place where you saved it. And here we should be able to see the design reuse block that we have created. But there is another way we can do the same thing. Let me show you how. First go to file, new and click on reuse block. Okay guys, if you check here, here we have a new reuse block, right? Here we have the schematics as well as a PCB file. So if we check the schematics file, we don't have anything at the moment. And if we check the PCB file, here also we don't have anything, right? Now let's go back to the schematics file and draw a small circuit. Okay guys, now we have a small circuit, right? Now let's save it. Press Ctrl S and go to designs and click on update PCB document. All right. Now let's close it. Now we have all the elements here. Now let's place it inside the PCB and let's route it. All right, now we have the PCB and schematics file ready. Now all you have to do is save both this file, press Ctrl S, now the PCB file, Ctrl S, now click on save to server, okay, simply click on that, let's name it, okay, now click on OK. Now this reuse block have been saved in our workspace root set. Now let's check it, go to design reuse, 
click on this drop down click on root set and here we go here we have the regulator module zero now this is the one that we created earlier and this is the one we created just now what's the difference now if you check the icon here there is a small difference right this one is a schematic snippet and this one is a complete reuse block this includes the schematics as well as the pcp now let's do one more thing we'll create a new project and see if we can use these reuse blocks in that new project all right now click on the file new project and give this project a name just project two yeah okay here we can see that a new test project has been created test project 2 now simply right click add new to project schematics now we will try to add the schematic that we created earlier right for that simply go here right click and click on place all right the cursor has changed now let's place it here and here we go instead of dragging and placing all the components in the schematics and drawing all the circuit we could simply place the reuse block directly into the circuit so this is how we use reuse blocks in Altium PCB designer we have done a lot of PCB projects, right? And in each project, I have explained different features of this Altium 365 and Altium PCB Designer. So, if you are interested in learning more about Altium PCB Designer or PCB designing in general, make sure you check out our previous videos. If you have any doubts regarding Altium PCB Designing or Electronics, make sure you ask it in the comments down below. If you like this video, make sure you give this video a like. And subscribe to our channel for more videos. See you in the next video.